Oh, God. I can't hardly stand to look at my face. Oh. Or even listen to my voice. Like, oh, my voice. I can't stand it. I don't want to listen. I don't. No, 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 no. Well, if I can make it there, I can make it anywhere. It's up to me. It's up to you. New York could be ours. And welcome to the vlog. Today, I am, I'm not out and about. I'm just here sitting in front of the camera, talking to you about what this journey has been like, the Identity Crisis Project. This is my dream. This is my dream, my baby. I wanted to be able to do this for so, so long. Just come out here and vlog. Tell my story. Let my light out. Let my weird, quirky, humor hopefully it's humorous there's probably people are like this isn't really that funny um this guy thinks he's funny and it's this is kind of boring but you know what i don't care i think i'm funny and that's all that matters <laughs> anyway just kind of a check-in with what i have been doing to now i think i've gotten around i think i'm close to 30 videos consistently boom 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 now there might have been a day where I doubled up because I missed a day, but I've been pretty consistent and I am giving myself a round of applause. Consistency is everything. And I think consistency, consistency, and believing in yourself, I think they go hand in hand. I think you're consistent when you believe in yourself. If you don't really believe and trust in your heart, what you're doing is is really spectacular or you just feel like man i'm onto something here if you don't have that feeling that kind of like bump 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 beating in your heart like this is pretty dang cool what i'm doing even though maybe nobody else is really paying attention or giving you that positive feedback if you're believing in yourself you're trusting yourself and you have that confidence then the consistency starts to show up because this this makes this just automatic so you just get up and if this sounds like I have maybe talked about this before, I've talked about this with innumerable people. Consistency has been the bane of my existence in the realm of sharing my creations, sharing my humor and, and all of my energy. That has been the missing link. Consistency, it's be and it's because I lack the, the self-confidence. I lack the belief in myself. I didn't trust myself. I just, I always would relent to what were other opinions of me, from what were the opinions of other people about me. And like I constantly needed that praise over and over, oh this is great, this is great Tim, blah blah. And it's like that's not reality, that's not the truth. The truth is there are going to be probably more people that dislike what you're doing than like it. That's just the way life is, there's so many different flavors so many different varieties, and that's fine. It doesn't matter. What matters is, like I was saying, that you believe it in your heart, you trust yourself, you have that confidence, like, I enjoy this. Like, I get such great satisfaction out of doing it that it doesn't matter what other people think. And that just makes everything go so much more Easily, it's not work, it's not a painstaking process to record a video, then upload it, then edit it, and then upload it again and all that stuff. It just makes it like, it's something that you wanna do. It's like eating, it's like breathing, it's just automatic. You wake up with, what am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? What am I gonna, cur what am I gonna create? What am I gonna, gonna, what am I gonna make? I'm getting tongue-tied. Yeah, it just becomes automatic, so. That process and then coming into YouTube with a belief in, my, in myself that I can do this, I can do this. I can do this one because I am creative. I know I'm creative. I don't need anybody else to tell me that. Two, I know I'm funny. I don't need anybody else to tell me that. And three, I get so much joy and satisfaction out of it. Even if nobody listens or watches at all, the joy and fulfillment that I get out of recording these videos and uploading them is is worth it. <laughs> like, so, yeah. 
So what I've been doing for nearly the last month is getting immense joy out of creating these videos for me. But I hope you, I hope you tangentially get some sort of, I don't know, laughter, joy. I don't know, it, something. I hope you get something out of it. Maybe I look funny and you laugh. Maybe there's something I said that makes you laugh. Maybe there's something that me and my dad have done that makes you laugh. But you know, I'm doing these videos because I am compelled to do it. It has been a journey to be able to become comfortable in front of the camera and not be like, oh God, I can't hardly stand to look at my face. Oh. Or even listen to my voice like, Oh, my voice, I can't stand it. I don't want to listen. I don't, no, 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 I ain't listening, I'm not listening. You know, to get over all of that, like the fear of myself, like how nutball is that? Like I literally stood in fear of myself. Because of all of that, I put all of my, like all of my ambition was locked up in getting um, these, accolades or, or get, getting this positive reinforcement from third parties, from other people. And it's like, that is a faulty foundation upon which to build anything. You have to believe in yourself, believe in your heart. So I've gotten over a lot, I've overcome a lot, and I am on some level comfortable. I can say I'm pretty comfortable in front of the camera. And I just keep pushing myself each and every day. And that's been, that's been part of it too, like coming up with ideas and creating something when there's nothing and and, and trying to make it entertaining and trying to make it informative to, to share some of the insight into my life and, and to become more proficient and, and more fluid and more comfortable. And you know, it's been a huge growth process. This is like a skill, like this is skill building on top of everything else. I'm building a skill, being able to communicate through this lens to you Right now I'm not communicating a lot, but you get the idea, right? And I had to, I had to become unafraid. I had to accept myself. I had to be able to look at myself. I had to be able to listen to myself and trust that, you know, I'm good enough, I'm funny enough and all that crap and, and go for it. And these last 30 days of getting these videos up and out have been some of the most fulfilling of my entire life. So I just wanna, just say, anybody out there that's on the fence of doing something, they might have some fear about it, you should just go and do it. Because the immense satisfaction that you're gonna reap from just doing it, regardless of how it looks, it could just totally collapse. But there's fun in that. There's a sense of satisfaction, there's a joy, there's a learning process. You'll figure it out, you gotta keep doing it. And maybe you don't like it at all, and that's all right too, you try something else but you'll never know until you try. And that's what the identity, I can't even talk. I can't even say my name of my entire YouTube channel. That's what the Identity Crisis Project is all about. Trying new things, being vulnerable, trusting in yourself that you're enough in the moment to step across that line and just do it, do it, do it. And see what the outcome is. You're not gonna die. You're not gonna die. So I keep pushing myself, hopefully to inspire you and we got one month down, we got, we got years to go. So I am, I am extremely excited. I thank each and every one of you out there that have watched a second of my video. I thank you, I thank you, I thank you. I do appreciate you. And uh, we're just getting started, okay? So with that said, I will see you so, so, so peace.